Good day, friends. It is me, HL Mod Tech, and I just had my new drone arrive, the Beeline F7. Friends, time to do some opening, so let's get cracking. All right, friends, so let's start with what's in the box. All right, friends, so this is the F7 GB2. It's got 4K Wi Fi camera, 3 axis gimbal, brushless motor night scene shooting function, modular design of the gimbal tripod, and super long remote control range. A couple more little strips we got to cut off back here. Oh, she's got a slider, disclaimer and safety guide, and a user manual, and a quick start guide. I'll get cracking on those in just a few minutes. All right, so the first thing I'm going to say is I like this case. We've got pouches with zippers in the front. Nothing stored there at the moment, but at least I've got some place I can put things. Lord knows we're always taking stuff with us when we fly. Zipper's got a sweet tab to hold as you pull. That's on both sides. Cool idea. Velcro to hold it in place. This is the Beeline F7. Wow, is that compact. It's got instructions on the side for how to open it. This looks like a locking mechanism. I'm going to just set this down and I'm going to open it after I check the manual. If we dig down to the bottom, this is a sweet way to hold the batteries in place. There is my battery. Friends, we've got extra blades, screws, and inside that same pouch is where you'll find the charging cord extra blades the little silica gel this is our controller love that it's got the grip underneath power button right now these are protected let's pop those off the antennas also come back underneath and everything is looking pretty darn sweet love the feel it of them in the hands friends i'm gonna get these batteries charged and we can get ready for our first flight Hey friends, I just want to remind you, make sure you peel off the sticker before you record your first video. Alright friends, so I have charged it up. Let's run through a few things I read when we were checking this out. It says, ensure that remote control antennas are opened correctly before operation. It takes about 40 seconds for the aircraft to connect to control. I'm going to peel that off now. I'm also going to peel off the other stickers because I won't need those anymore. So friends, let's quickly run through the quick start. We need to add the drone. I'm going to add mine to my iPhone. Obviously, we just scan it and add it. Charge the batteries, which I already did. This clip simply pulls off like this. Also, underneath, we need to take off this clip. Easy peasy. Now the gimbal is free. And then notice the F7 logo. These two arms pull forward. And these two flip down and under. So make sure where you've got the b wine in the back. And then when you flip this down, if you find your propeller's not quite right, there is an angle where you can bring that up just like that. And there, my friends, is the b wine F7 in all her glory. shock absorbers, 4K camera. Let's see a couple more steps and get ready to take her out for that first flight. So we unfold the antenna. I'll do that outside. Unfold the handle. Already got that. Attach our phone. That's easy peasy. We're going to select a place to fly. Going to lock it at 65 feet starting out. Make sure there's nothing on the return home. Power it on until the aircraft plays us down. Press two times to power on the transmitter. The light on the back of the drone will go from red to green after about 40 seconds. And then we'll have the DD when the pairing is completed. Make sure we connect Wi-Fi on the phone. Calibrate the compass with thumbs up and in. Rotate the aircraft horizontally about one to two turns. Also do it vertically one to two turns to get it calibrated. Also gyroscope, remember we were in for the compass, out for the gyroscope. 
and then do a self inspection about 20 seconds on a on a flat surface to make sure it's groovy it'll search for GPS automatically and then we can start the motors by pulling down and in takeoff is up new to flying drones we should check the app I have flown a few so I'm not too worried about that and then common problems friends it's time to take it outside and find a place to fly all right friends let's take this little critter out for a flight powered on two taps to power this on they say it takes about 45 seconds to connect as you can see that screen is pretty darn sweet I'm gonna wake up this screen and connect the app it is the B wine app I am going to confirm it switch to controls I'm going to examine I'm going to confirm this. While I'm here, I'm going to switch to video mode. Notice right now it is still not connected because the battery is not detected. I'm going to connect to the Wi-Fi of the drone while I'm waiting. I am connected to the Wi-Fi of the drone. That's cool. Let's go back to the app. So while I'm waiting, let's check out all the things we can find on our display gimbal up gimbal down tells you which way you're moving it this is zoom out and zoom mode uh, right now you can see it just kicked in that it's ready for me to connect to it you can see all my batteries are there so that's the 45 second wait so right now we're doing our calibration dance we've all done this before switch set her back down Let's take off. Let's get her hovering over here. Get my camera adjusted. It is a bit breezy, but as you can see, she is staying nice and handy dandy. Uh, out here on the front, this button is record video. So now we are in video mode. Let's keep it low. Fly it out there a little ways and see what we can see. Right now I have still got her locked in uh, beginner mode, which is pretty much a good idea whenever you're starting out with a drone. You'll have lots of time to do crazy stuff the more you play with it. Let's see if we can take the gimbal and aim it down at us. That's kind of fun. if we can get it on camera you see as we're flying we can adjust it that easily let's see what it looks like as we zoom in <laughs> there it is one click zoom pretty wild stuff Let's bring it in for a landing quick. Landing of course is super simple. Simply click the button 
and slide to say you really want to. There we go. Doesn't get much slicker than that. Alrighty friends, so there you have it, a fun first flight and setup of the Beeline F7. Friends, it was super simple to fly, loved the controls, the remote was awesome, the video footage was slick as well, and everything worked just like you'd expect. Now friends, this is just a first flight, I've got a lot more things to play with, I want to try all the intelligent modes. If you make sure you stay tuned to my channel, you'll see those as soon as I get them created. Friends, I'm looking forward to features like the night shooting, and I can guarantee you that I've already been playing with it in the wind. It has been an awesome drone. Right now, you can see that you can snag it for $449.99. There is also, though, a $75 coupon at the moment. Friends, I hope you enjoyed this video, and if you did, please give it a like. Please also hit that share button so more people can learn about HL Mod Tech. Of course, if you've got a question, comment, or suggestion, add it down below. And if you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Smash that subscribe button and last but not least, hit that notification bell if you want to be the first to know when there's a brand new video from me, HL Mod Tech. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.